Hey guys, David here with OBD Genie. We just got done installing our rear view camera and now we're going to use the OBD Genie to enable the camera to work. What I wanted to show you today was how quick, simple, and easy the Genie is to use. Let's get started. Okay, so what we're going to do now is put the vehicle in the on or run position. This is the position where the vehicle is actually on, but the engine is not running. This goes for all Ford, GM, and FCA vehicles. The FCA includes the Chrysler, Dodge, Jeep, and Ram. Let me show you how. Now that it's in the on or run position, go ahead and let it sit for about 30 seconds or so. This allows the vehicle's computers to really get running and get started. Okay, now that we have the vehicle in the on or run position, we're ready to install the Genie. So now as you see, the Genie has gone to the green light. That means the programming is complete. Often in most vehicles, you may also hear the horn beep, just like we did here. That is just letting us know that again, the programming is indeed complete. At this point, we can go ahead and remove the Genie and just stow away for safekeeping. If for whatever reason the Genie didn't go to a green light initially, simply remove the keys, let the vehicle sit for a couple of minutes, and then restart the process. Okay, now that we have our software, let's go ahead and put this in reverse to ensure that we do have our backup camera. Yep, there we are, excellent. Genie did its job again. So as you can see, simple and easy, happens in a matter of minutes. As usual, feel free to reach out anytime you need anything here at OBD Genie. Congratulations on all your upgrades and take care.